Hey guys, what's up? Tech Talker here for another Photoshop Elements tutorial, home of the green light bulb. And today I'm going to be showing you how to make yourself look like a sketch. Now, there's two different methods one that looks like this, and another one that has a squ bunch of squig squiggly lines, and it's pretty neat also. And then for the bonus, for the last like minute, I'm going to show you a bunch of different um, cool color things you can do with yourself also. So, first, start off by importing your pit picture. Now, I'm going to use old bush here but to um, and open up your picture that you took, go to File, Open, and then select the picture. Alright, so here we go. First, we're going to start off by doing Control-J. Control-J. Now, if you don't like that, then just go to Layer, New, and then Layer via Copy. Alright, so here we got our duplicate layer. Uncheck the little eye. <clears throat> and make sure we're on layer 1 to begin with. Now, adjust the levels in contrast to help find the edges. So, to do this, go to Enhance and then auto contrast alright okay now we're gonna sharpen the edges so go to filter stylize wait my bad we're gonna go to filter oh we can't we actually can't sharpen the edges in this because it's um it's just it's um but if you have an older version you can sharpen the edges but in this one you can't so let's ignore that part all right, so now we're going to be removing the color. So to do this, go to Enhance, Adjust Color, Remove Color. Now we've got black and white. All right, now we're going to Control-J. Right, like that. All right, now we're going to Invert Layer 1 to create a negative. So we're going to click on Layer 1, oh, Layer 1, and then do Control-I, just like that. Alright, now we're going to um, do uh, color dodge. To do this, go up to normal, and then you'll see it right here, color dodge. Go ahead and click that. Alright, now do this to both. There we go. Alright, now we're going to be creating the sketch. Now to do this, go up to filter, stylize, oh wait. Um, filter blur and then Caucasian blur. Now, as you see, we are beginning to see what looks as if of a sketch of um, President Bush. Now, you can adjust this little bar here. You can make it look, you know, just different um, ways of shading that you want. So I'll say right about there. And then we got ourselves a sketch George Bush. So that's method one. So I'm just gonna now you can just say that, but go in the file and say that. But so I'm gonna delete the ones that we just did. All right, so here now here is the second method. So we're gonna duplicate the layer, Control J. All right, um, click the little eye. Make sure we're on layer one. And now we're gonna adjust the levels and contrast to help find the edges. So to do this, we're gonna go to Enhance, and then Auto Contrast. And Enhance Auto. We'll just keep it at Auto Contrast. All right. Now we're gonna um, convert to black and white. But um, the second method, I honestly think, looks cooler without black and white, but, um, so, but, well, let's just keep it, uh, with, I'll just make it, uh, in black and white. So, to do this, like I just said, we're gonna go to enhance, adjust color, remove color. So, yep, uh, same thing as before. Alright, so now, to find the edges of the objects, we're gonna go to filter, stylize, find edges. Now, there's that, but we don't want that just yet. So now we're going to adjust the brightness and contrast to remove as much shading as possible while leaving the lines intact. So to do this, we're going to go to Enhance, Adjust Lighting, and then Brightness slash Contrast. Alright, now we want to remove as much shading as possible. Just like that. Now that's method two. Which, with the squiggly lines. Or the other one was more like this. Alright. Now that um, I showed you how to make sketches of yourself. Now if you want those in color. Just ignore the part about removing the color. And just do the rest. So now I'm going to show you a bunch of different ways. To make your um, face pretty neat. Now to do this. We're going to start off by doing control J. As we always do. Uncheck the eye. Now we're going to go up to filter. Well first select your color that you want your face to be. Let's do whatever yellow for this. <clears throat> All right, filter, stylize, extrude. 
Now, as you see here, we got a bunch of little blocks. Now, I think that's pretty cool, but that's not really what I wanted. Control Z, that. Here's another one. <clears throat> Glowing edges, where you can actually adjust the glow as much as you want it, and you can make yourself look like night, night, and you're a cool glowing dude. <laughs> Alright, let's try out another one here. Trace Contour, this is a neat one. So, you can, be, now those are the natural colors, you can't change those, sadly, but, you can, yep, so that's like, you know. Now, here is the coolest ones. Sketch, Conte Crayon. Here's one I find cool. So, you can adjust the relief and the scaling. Like so. Make it look pretty cool. Alright. Now, um, we're getting to the best one here. Just hold on, guys. Note paper. This one's also pretty cool. Let's change it. Have that all the way down. <laughs> look at that. Let's have that all the way down. Image balance right there. Pretty neat. Now, here is the best one, I think. Torn edges. Now I always make smoothness all the way up. And this, we can adjust here. Make the contrast right about there. There we go. And now you can paste other colors in. Say I want yellow and black. Go ahead and click on the paint can. Yeah, pretty neat. I really like this one the best, but I also like um torn I mean notebook too as well. So those are a few different cool things you can do with your face, you know, edit, make yourself look like a sketch. I hope you guys enjoy. Please <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy. Please um rate, comment, and subscribe. Um thumbs up, please. Thank you very much. And that was my tech talker tutorial on how to make yourself uh, look like a sketch and many different methods of doing this. Remember, home of the green light bulb, the a little electricity <laughs> of smartness. Yeah, sorry, I'm sick. <clears throat> but uh, please check out all my other videos. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much.